Hello friends! Today I am here with a video where I am finally starting my BTS binder. Uh, it has been a long time coming. I have been ARMY for almost one and a half years now and I am finally going to start setting up a binder and I obviously want to take you along on this journey. Um, I will say quite honestly I'm just going to start already like sleeping stuff as I go um I will say quite honestly that I do not really have a plan of how I want to set this up um I think I what I'm going to do now is for the most part I will just like stick with well, this is the thing. For the album photo cards, what I'm thinking is what I want to do for now um, is just put them in a nine pocket sleeve chronologically, <laughs> which is just how I have been kind of collecting them ever since, like, even with not having them in a binder, like the pile that I had, it's just always been chronologically and I don't mean chronologically as an album order I mean chronologically as in um like this was the first photo card that I got this was the second photo card that I got and I think for now I'm just going to do it like this um we'll see how it's going to go for other things let me actually I just want to make sure I'm genuinely like a little bit scared that the sleeves that I bought are not going to Okay, they barely fit in here. Like, they fit just right. <laughs> okay. Um, but yeah, I think that this is just what I am going to do for now. Um, and then I think once I actually have everything set up, once I have all of the things in the binder, everything in... Uh, like pocket pages and stuff I think that is probably when I will like just get more of a feeling for how I actually want to sort things and if I maybe want to do a nine pocket sleeve sleeve per member um, because I, I think these are um, because I think that no because I um, collect just basically whoever I pull unless like you know just like automatically with friends um like a good trade comes up why are these I mean I dropped these earlier that's probably why why they are uh all over the place and not I know this is a little bit bright but I'd honestly rather have it a little bit too bright than a little bit too um dark uh but yeah I what the heck was I talking about? This is going to be, this is obviously going to be a long video. Um, so I already apologize for like how many tangents I'm going to go on. And like how many random things I'm going to talk about. How often I will like just lose track of what I was talking about. Um, but yeah, I don't know. I feel like for now, I just want to put all the things in a binder. I'm trying to think if I... Hmm. This is There's just a lot of things that I will figure out as I go. And I think that even just how I want to sort them is something... Oh, now I remember what I was talking about. This is going to be... This is going to be chaotic a little bit. Um, How many do I have now? Maybe I should like see if I can already kind of do this um I'm also always I need to be careful sometimes you can see this in my travel videos like you will have like strands of my hair um in the video because I just like uh have my head too far forward <laughs> so I will try to be uh, a little bit more aware of that but yeah what I was trying to say, once again, I went on a tangent. Um, I'm thinking of maybe also just like doing a pocket page per member and then just fill them up, you know, as I go. 
um, because I just keep uh, usually whatever whoever I pull um, but these are all things that I truly think I'm just going to figure out oh I put this in questionably um, those are things that I'm going to figure out as I go and yeah I, I for now I'm just going to stick with like because obviously this binder thing is like new to me right like setting up a binder putting all of these cards into these pocket sleeves that is all very new to me so I am just like you know even though I have been uh especially uh watching my best friend Melanie I, I I watch her videos and I've just you know kind of been following her hello following her um journey of collecting like since the beginning and she's also definitely the one that not only inspired me to do this but who also just like first of all helps me a lot with my collection in general by just like sending me stuff or sometimes we are able to trade as well um but also just like help me with so many like questions that I had but also just truly like again like inspired me but also oh no this is this is annoying now because wait where is the take out gone um this is annoying now because I'm like I obviously these belong together and I'd have to kind of like split them now I'm just okay I'm just going to stick with it I will figure everything out eventually um but yeah not only has she inspired me just like me seeing her okay okay wait 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 oh I fucked up <laughs> I think I'm gonna not only has she can I can I finish the sentence or am I gonna get distracted by something again um not only has she just inspired me but she also just like just really motivated me and I feel like for a long time I just didn't really want a binder and then when I kind of started being like okay my collection is at a point where I feel like you know what I actually do not hate this I thought I I wasn't sure but I actually do not hate this um yeah but when I was kind of like starting I feel like this is always a really really satisfying part as well to see the backs of it I can only imagine uh if you collect the whole sets for the love yourselves I know that they make like a pattern I feel like that must be especially amazing as well Anyway, um, once I kind of like started realizing, okay, it is time for me to have a binder just so I can have a place to put all my stuff. Um, I think, I think I'm also going to do it like that. Uh, I would not have been actually able to do it without her, without, without her kind of just like, I don't know, just giving me, um, advice, but also just like, I don't know just like listening to like my doubts about it and stuff like that and yeah it just really helped me with even like me just like knowing the stuff that I um kind of like have to buy for um for being able to like set up a proper binder like I would not have even known the things that you can kind of get to set up a binder like this if it wasn't for her videos um so yeah I you know I am not new to the idea of collecting uh but just like me setting up my own binder is just something that is very new to me so I think in whatever ways I can I am just going to stick to what I know and then we'll just see how it all develops as I go okay this is obviously a memories photo card uh, there's another special photo card as well <laughs> I will tell you honestly I am including these just so that I can fill nine pocket, like two nine pocket sleeves with these cards. Um, eventually, I would want to, like right now, I'll, I'll just kind of, will try to just like have as little empty uh, pockets as possible. 
but I think eventually um, maybe as my collection grows as well I would want to um, you know like have like a page where I put like special kinds of photo cards and not put them together with the album photo cards but that is another thing let me sleep these first that is another thing that is just going to uh develop with time um i also as i just kind of like talked about melanie and how she has inspired me and stuff i definitely want to melanie also has a channel if you do not know i talk about her almost every video but um in case you are not subscribed to her, I will leave a link in the description. This is actually fitting. The next thing I was going to say, or the next person I was going to talk about, is my friend Melis, who also has a channel. And she also only just started a binder. She gave this photo card to me because I cannot pull Yungi. Um, as you might be able to... Like, these are all photo cards that I pulled myself. Uh, for the Oh Are You Late 2, I pulled JK, but I gave that one to Melanie. Um, this one I traded with her because I pulled Jimin. And this one I did a three-way trade with um, Melanie and Maylis, where I sent the JK that I pulled to Melanie. Melanie sent the Namjoon that she pulled to Maylis, and then Maylis, um sent the Hobie that she pulled to me. Um, but basically this is like the only Yungi um, album photo card that I have because I cannot pull that man for the life of me. Um, so Melis was very, very kind to gift me that photo card for Christmas and I'm feeling very blessed. But once again, what I was going to say, um, she also has a channel, also just started her binder and she has also helped me with just like things to get especially because she is european too so she just helped me with a couple of things that um like i wasn't really sure where to get some of the like pocket sleeves and stuff again i will say now that everything is in there i'm like i do not hate it <laughs> um um yeah but she she also really helped me with just like knowing where to like get things or what to look for in like uh you know i mean she's from france and i'm from germany so that's not the same language but uh still she like sent me a link to something on amazon france and it helped me finding uh the same thing on amazon germany when before like the eight pocket sleeves i could not find them <laughs> and then with her help i found that and she's also just been like helping me with like Mercari stuff so very very thankful to them both um am I doing this right how am I gonna do them I should probably do them the same way that I did these with like them facing towards this uh side so how about like I mean yeah talking that's all great but I also just need to concentrate just a little bit um yeah obviously as you can see i am going to um i feel like technically technically after this hobby photo card i would have to start the b photo cards here but obviously with b um having come with all the members plus an ot7 photo card plus the polaroid i think it's really nice for me to set this all up in one nine pocket page so that is what i'm going to do with these three pages for now <laughs> yeah I actually f I'm finding this one very very satisfying yeah 
oh that's kind of, i don't know that personally kind of bothers me if i'm honest okay i think the next thing that i'm going to do is i'm going to uh do these two with the eight pocket sleeves um because those are also going to be relatively easy i think those um because these are like full sets i also have these two um hobby cards uh this one from the uh love yourself the final and then this one from magic shop this one was um gifted to me by melanie this one was gifted to me by my friend amy who i'm also gonna leave a link in the description um so we'll see about these two but for the map of the soul tour and the map of the soul one i bought the full sets um so those are going to fit in here nicely uh me never having these sort of oh yeah right i have several hobbies yeah because melanie said okay okay so i think what i'm going to do melanie sent me uh two hobbies for the map of the soul tour uh i funnily enough i bought like she sent me two hobbies i bought one set and there was a duplicate which like you know the chances were kind of low it still happened but i think I'll probably just put these two in an a pocket page with the other two hobby cards that I have. Um, and then I'm just going to put this full set together. Okay, I'm trying to think. This one is a little bit... So, wait, if it's in the binder like this, that means that... Where do these go in? These go in here. I think I'm going to do it like this. For this Namjoon card. And then, wait, no. <sighs> this is already, I'm, I'm like, hmm. Me, this is going to be easy. Oh, is it though? Is it? <laughs> uh, I almost think I want to actually put this one up here. No, I think I like this, that these two, like, they are facing like this. And then the other ones are going to be facing like this. And then, um, I think I'm just, <sighs> hmm. If, I feel like if all of them were facing this way, like, if I do it like this, right? If all of them, I would be like, here, Namjoon goes here. And then, um jk goes here depending on where i would put the group picture but these two are what makes me think like i want to have namjoon there but then it's still the majority of it is still i hate that this is actually already putting me through it <laughs> so uh okay i think i'm just gonna do it like this and maybe no, I don't know. I don't know. Again, this is all trial and error. This is me starting a binder, trying things, just seeing how it works, seeing how I feel about things. We're just going to vibe for now. And um, I can always change things later on. Okay, I definitely uh, like... I'm going to put this one here. And I like well and then it's still see then it's still even if it's like this it's still like the kind of okay i think this is satisfying and i just like that it's like kyung line and then um makne line oh honestly there's something really really satisfying about sliding these cards into the eight pocket sleeves can i just say that Okay, uh, I think I'm going to put this one next. Again, all these things, it's ma mainly just for now. This is... This... Oh. Okay, I am... There are little things that are upsetting me. These are... I was like, this is so satisfying. And then I realized this. And I'm just like, why? 
Why did they do that? <laughs> okay, this is not going to be a problem with the Map of the Soul 1 cards because the um, subunit card that I got for this set, I sent that to Melanie and um, I think I'm going to do like this again. I sent that one to Melanie and then for my birthday, she sent me this uh, take card and I am just, I'm just going to be, because I think it will look nice. Um, I am just going to put them next to each other and I'm really happy because it means that I will have filled a eight pocket sleeves, even though I gave one of the cards away. And it also means that there's not, um, <laughs> that there's not a subunit card that is going to face the quote unquote wrong way. It almost makes me want to give this one away and then I would just put the non-duplicate Hobie. But then that one wouldn't... Again, this is all trial and error. Uh, I'll just do... I Oh, this is actually... I actually have one and two. <laughs> so I think I'm just going to put one first and then two. Hey, this one makes me very happy. All right. Um, yeah, and then I'll just put these in. I don't know if I have other stuff that's kind of like, quote unquote, random uh, that I think would fit um, that I could maybe put in here with these hobby cards. We'll see, we'll see as we go. I'll do this by numbers as well. This is six out of eight. This is eight out of eight. So I'll do this one first. Hello. <laughs> that inside no okay i'm just going to leave this like this for now <laughs> okay this side is definitely starting to get too heavy <laughs> um all right oh what do i okay you know what i think i'm going to actually do the notes because i think i want the notes to be um, probably the last thing one of the last last things so i can put them in here and have them you know like have like a counterweight i'm just going to put these um in here like this for now and eventually at some point in my life i don't know when that day will come but that day will come at some point I will own all the versions of all the BTS albums and um, that is when I will have really nice fitting notes um, pages as well for now. This is what we have to deal with but this one is going to be really nice. Let's see, this is one. Yeah, for now, just with, you know, also just like starting to get into um, other groups and wanting to collect uh, at least, you know, even if it's not photo cards, I at least have other groups, Pentagon, TXT and Monster X as of right now, where I want to get their albums. And I just kind of want to focus on basically having one version of every album like I have the only album that I'm missing um, from BTS is the Young Forever uh, one that one I am missing but that will definitely be added to my collection okay perfect good counterweight 
uh, I think next what I will do is, oh, you know what? I should, this is a, this is a thing. So I'm thinking of maybe potentially, um, like melting my own sleeves for this because these are Bang Bang Con, um, cards. Those were also like all four of those were sent to me by Melanie. I feel so so happy and so very blessed. Um, but I think I definitely want them together. So I'm thinking, would that technically, yeah, technically, I could just like just make a page like this where I could just fit them in like this. Um, if I melted a page myself, I have tried it a little bit. I'm not like, um, it's still a thing that I'm just like trying i guess for now just because it's four cards and i wouldn't really know where else to fit these in obviously these would fit in the eight pocket pages but these would not right yeah so i think i'm just going to hmm, for now i think i'm also just going to fit them in a four pocket sleeve like this and then maybe at one point I will like melt my own custom uh, four pocket sleeve to have to be able to have them like this. Yeah, we'll just vibe with this for now. I think I'm going to continue with season's greeting stuff. I don't really know what to do with these ID photos. I'm like, do I just put the ID photos into nine pocket sleeves? <laughs> I don't know if this is going to look wild, probably. And then it's also obviously, hmm. I don't know. Okay, I will worry about these later. <laughs> um. I'll just sleeve these for now. sleeve <laughs> or maybe if I put them in directly this is this is so questionable definitely the most questionable part of this um <sighs> I'll I'll figure this out later for now we're vibing we're vibing and then I think because I want to keep all the season's greeting things together, this is also the thing. I don't know. I would like to use these stickers actually eventually at some point. So I'm thinking instead of like individually putting them into maybe like a four pocket sleeve to just put them in like one in a one pocket sleeve and just ah, I'll set these aside for now. Um, but I think I want to just put this Yungi photo card. Um, oh, this Yungi, not photo card. This Yungi photo. Um, maybe. Mm, could try putting him in one of those. Or I have this photo as well. Um, from memories that Melanie sent me so maybe I don't I won't put this with season's greetings but I'll just put these two together this is another thing where I could potentially just like make my own pocket sleeve for it where I just truly just like put basically one pocket just in the middle so that it just like doesn't move around Like if I melted it so that it would have, you know, that could be a thing. I feel like I would kind of like that. But those are all things that I will figure out eventually as well. So I think what I'm going to do 
is right now. Wait. It has to be here, right? Yeah. Right now, I think, because it fits, I'm going to put these two like special photos together and then I'll just have them somewhere <laughs> this is so I don't know <laughs> probably somewhere at the end here um okay while we're at season's greeting stuff I am going to um look at the stuff from last year's season's greetings okay these I actually wanted to see I don't think these would fit, right? I'm like, there's no way this would fit. Nope. <laughs> Clearly not. Okay. That means I will... Um, oh, 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 let me do... Oh god, I've made a mess of things here for sure. I think I'll just, these are also, I'm also like these stickers. I know I want to use them eventually, but for now I'm also just going to put them in, uh, maybe I'll put them like this in a, I guess I could do that with these as well for now. Oh yeah, especially because there's one per member, right? So if I use a four, if I use a four pocket sleeve and then I do them double like this, with this one I have eight. This might be something. Okay, I'm going to put these in four pocket sleeves. I'm going to put these in four pocket sleeves. I don't, I only have these three uh, because <laughs> the other th uh, four uh, I have put into a frame that's on my wall. Um, I'm going to put this in one big one. And then what else do I have? Oh, I obviously also have the ID cards for this. Season's greetings. Maybe I'll truly just try and put these in a nine pocket sleeve and just see what happens. And then I'll put these all individually. Well, maybe I'll also do them like this into one pocket sleeves. <laughs> worth it questionable okay i'm thinking i just have these like you know things that were like album inclusions where i'm kind of just like questioning what to do with it um i mean this is obviously the photo card but i think i'm just going to 
um, put again for now just going to put this photo card in a four pocket sleeve with this persona postcard of Tay maybe like this and then just put them um, well this is the question now I feel like I want to put them here I mean technically if I'm gonna go chronologically where I should put them is here because that's kind of when I uh, pulled after <laughs> it doesn't matter and then I'm gonna put these here I need to see I think Mailers said these do not fit into a four pocket sleeve okay I could just do them aesthetically I guess I wouldn't mind that but I would kind of like would want the mirrors together maybe these two and then these two yeah, I'm just I'm just going to go by like what I personally find aesthetically pleasing. <laughs> I think I'll start with the Yungi one just because I feel like that is the one that's like so significant. <laughs> So I have sticker things, which I'm not really sure yet if I even want to put them in the binder. I um, also have this still. And I have these, I think I'm going to do these Medi Heel um, things first. Oh god, this is so annoying with the stickers. <sighs> <laughs> still I'm trying to think maybe I'll put this I almost feel like I'm just going to maybe put this here I'll eventually once I feel like I have my shelf say uh, shelf space settled again uh, I think I'll put this on my shelf like I had before, but for now I'll just leave it in here. Um, okay, I think those are all things like I these stickers I specifically bought because I knew eventually I wanted to use them. So I think I have this little like pouch here. So I think I'll just put those in here and I mean those are also things that I will just use eventually I already have one of those is already stuck in my journal I think maybe one of those I would want to keep but you know what because this is technically an album inclusion I'm going to put two of those in here because I'd want to use those and then And now I'm wondering those fit as well. You know what? I'm just again. I'm just gonna roll with it. Album inclusions, ta-da. <laughs> um, and then I think maybe this is again two of those I've used. I think two of those, maybe eventually one of those. I just want to keep nice and safe. Um, so. 
think I'm just going to and ah, this is ah, this is this is I think I ha I think I have to Well, but then I want the bee inclusions to be after the bee stuff. But I kind of like it when all when the nine pocket sleeves are all one after another. But then obviously I use them later on for like season's greeting things as well. I just, I don't know what I'm doing. I really don't. I'll just... Mm. <laughs> I'll just do it like this for now. Okay now let me see i had put everything like all the stuff on my bed and i'm like do i actually have everything i think i do i think this is everything that i have this is how much stuff i have put in the binder right now okay friends i have a good feeling that this is everything um just going to flip through this right now this was a lot of fun uh definitely um interesting um we'll see how the binder will develop with time but as of january 2021 this is what my binder looks like and honestly i was such a uh, I don't know, I was so not bothered about not having a binder for so long. It really was only because I, my collection had just grown so much that I started being like, I need a binder now. Um, I feel like I probably could have lived without a binder my entire life. But I will absolutely say... That now that everything has its rightful, well, hmm, its space in the binder, we'll see about the rightful, um, <laughs> for example, um, I feel really good and really happy and I think it looks really nice and right now I am also... Um, genuinely feeling really happy that I did decide to go with like this binder that's like very purple and then has this like I don't even know how you would describe this color but has this color on the inside I I'm very happy with this color as of right now um, but yeah that is my uh, BTS binder as of right now um, I'm excited to see this binder grow I'm excited to see this binder change with time with more things but I feel really really happy that I have everything set up right now and I just hope that you enjoyed watching this I know it was a long but I just hope that you enjoyed watching it and um yeah just thank you so much for watching and I will see you with a new video very soon oh god how do I do my thing now do I just like mm, bye